Welcome students in my new tutorial based upon Adobe Photoshop and today I'll be introduce you some further interesting tools of Adobe Photoshop. So first of all for that I'll be opening one of the image. So I'll be opening my folder and suppose any image I'll select from here. Uh, suppose this one I'll select and I'll directly drag it down. And of course, uh, you can download this image from the link provided at the bottom. So I'll double click it just to open this image. So last time, I just told you about lasso tool, polygon and magnetic lasso tool. And now the further crop tool, the shortcut is C. If you click it, it is used to delete the unwanted parts of the image. For example, suppose I just want to have this part, this much. Suppose this part I just want to take and rest of the part I want to delete. That means I need to crop this image. And for cropping this image, I'll just, I can select it like this. It's showing me like this. And then press enter key. As a result, you will see rest of the part of the image has been deleted. So it's very simple you see now moving ahead with another tool perspective crop tool before that i want to do undo command so that i can give the demo once again now perspective crop tool and with the help of this tool also either you can crop it but little different it is so here what i am doing both i am clicking it here and then clicking it suppose like this suppose this and suppose this now you see orientation of the tool when I'll enter see how it's been cropped so overall the image has been changed orientation of the image has been changed and little bit it's scaled also so if you want this kind of changes you can use this tool I hope this both the tools are clear. These tools, slice tool and slice like tool, I'll be teaching you afterwards. Actually, these are used to cut the part of the images, slice the parts of the images, uh, which are used for websites so that they can load easily. So this I'll te teach you afterwards. Now simply frame tool, frame tool. This is a new tool. So I'll just click this tool and what I'll do, firstly I'll use undo command and then I'll make one frame here okay you could see here this kind of new frame one uh, layer is there and then i'll directly drag one image here it allows you to place one image in between so suppose directly now i'm using this image and dragging it towards my adobe photoshop and directly placing it in this frame and you see this image is been placed inside this frame okay so i just for moving it i'll use move tool and then one more frame i'll put suppose here somewhere new frame i have inserted one new frame and then from here i am placing one other image and placing it here so you could see i am able to put two images here and you could see here if i'll show you the layers this is the basic layer and here two layers so this is the basic use of frame tool create placeholder frame for images so i hope this is clear uh, with this i'll close my tutorial this will be a short tutorial so if you like my explanation please do like share and comment and if you have not subscribed my channel please subscribe it okay bye bye take care Meet you soon in my next tutorial.